Hey, good morning, gang, and welcome to another bald eagle fishing adventure. And today, 4th of July. Yeah. So, happy 4th of July to all the Americans, and woohoo! Yep. Anyway, so we're out here on uh, beautiful Bodega Bay this morning. Uh, got a nice uh, overcast, which is my favorite. A little drizzle, and uh, I believe there's some salmon that want to commit suicide. I kind of got that feeling going on, you know what I mean? So, I got my lucky charm with me. I got all the ducks in a row. <laughs> Anyways, I'm looking for some really great things to happen today. So you know the drill, guys. Follow us out to the fishing grounds. Let's see what we put on board the bald eagle today for the 4th of July, all right? We'll see you, gang, out to the fishing grounds. All right, gang. Bye. Left one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh? Yeah. He's staying gear. Okay. Oh, yeah, he's on. Okay. Come over and start reeling. Okay, it's in neutral now. Okay. Step back. He's in. Ooh, another nice one. Nice one. Oh shit, yeah. Wow. That's a beauty. Yeah, hot damn, for sure. Beautiful. Okay, let me have this. Wow, barely lift it. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, this one's a little smaller, 27 inches. Just a little over 27, but nice We're bit. bit. We're getting bit. All right. Oh, we got those. Hey, Tony on the real estate. Come back to Kevin. Keep the voting gear. Yeah, you got a fish here. Come and take this one. Come take this one. Keep reeling. Okay. Uh oh, something bad just happened. We just lost our engine, our big engine. There's oil all in the water. Okay, I think we're tangled. Oh, it's still running. Oh, I thought there was something. Okay, can you get up there? Yeah. Okay. Come swap over. There you go. Step back. Yeah. Nope. Take him on this side over here. There you go. Just keep fighting him. He's in. Nice fish, babe. Okay. Oh yeah, this is a good one. Woo! All right. Nice fish. Oh. Yep. Look at that. Hold it up. My wife got a really nice beauty right here. <laughs> Woo! That's a nice one. Yeah, babe. Way to go, huh? She got problems. It's time to go home. Yeah. Shut it off for now. 
Let me go ahead and bring this stuff up. Okay. Go ahead and work on this point, start reeling. Yeah. Hey gang, so uh, wow, we had another bald eagle fishing adventure today. <laughs> We've had a couple challenges the last couple times, and uh, or at least the last time, and we had a challenge today. You saw that, you know, I was back here on the motor. Uh, I maybe you did, maybe you didn't. I don't know, but uh, it all of a sudden kind of started having a little bit of a rough, rough run, uh, and started smelling gas. And uh, we had already two salmon in the boat at the time, um, and so at eleven o'clock, you know, when this started acting up, we just kind of said, "That's it, we're done. We're going to get out of here." And uh, I tried looking at it out there, and uh, but you know, out on the ocean, it's difficult and kind of dangerous. I even pulled the engine cover to look at it. Um, it's not really what you want to do out there. So luckily, I was still able to get in. And um, uh, after I got back here to the dock and I pulled the engine cover, I found that there is um, a little pipe, little tiny fuel pipe. Uh, where a fuel line comes in and a fuel line goes out uh, to the engine, to the, uh, to the uh, intakes. And uh, that little piece of metal pipe, um, over the years, I guess, it just got a couple of pinholes and it's spraying fuel. So anyways, um, that's where the smell of the fuel and why the engine wasn't running, because uh, running as well as it should is just not getting all the fuel. Anyways, it's always a good day when you can get back in on your own power and I'm glad that that happened and uh, it doesn't look like a, a real tremendous amount of time of effort to fix so uh, I've been all over this motor so <laughs> anyways we'll get it taken care of but we got two beautiful salmon out of today and I call it a success right yes I mean all in all it's a good day we got back here it's a little after 12 right now and uh, did not have to make the phone call to Coast Guard had to do that in the past, so I'm really happy that wasn't the case today. Anyways, I'm going to show you guys a couple of those salmon that we got. We can edit a little bit mm -hmm. of this. Yeah. You want to hold one, or you want me to hold one? No. Okay. I end up dropping. So, really, a couple of nice beauties. We got a 29-incher and a 27-incher. Uh, yeah, I loved would have had. I would have loved to had limits today, but you know sometimes that just doesn't happen. It was a little on the slow side out there today, um, but nonetheless, hey, all in all, two beautiful salmon got back in on our power. Doesn't look like a horrible fix. I'm a lucky guy. <laughs> so, anyways, God bless all of you, and as always, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, found it entertaining, please subscribe. We appreciate the support. God bless all of you, and happy Fourth of July. Yes. Take care, happy gang. Fourth, guys. We'll see ya. So just wanted to show you guys the little culprit um, that caused the issue to my uh, my uh, F200 uh, out, outboard on my Yamaha. It's a fuel valve. And on this fuel valve, there is a little tiny seam. I mean, it is really micro. I can't even really see it in here. Um, but anyways, there's a seam that goes across up and down and it's got little uh, micro corrosion to it and it was spraying just a little bit of fuel out of this. Well, it was enough that it was causing um, the uh, fuel injectors not to get all the fuel they needed and it caused the engine to run extremely rough. But uh, like I had stated, I'm glad we were able to get in on our own power. $160 little part, it's a fuel valve and you know it's only offered by Yamaha. So anyways, but it could have been a lot worse and I am so grateful that I, it was just this and it took me about an hour to put in. Um, you know, when I first saw that slick on the water, I thought, oh my God, I just blew my engine, it's, it's gone. And you know, that's a $20,000 bill. So I'll take the $160 part all day long. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you on the next video.